Hi everyone, Julie Powell here. In this video, I'm going to do a quick run through on how to add some candle flames to your candle if you didn't actually have them um, lit in your shot. So for instance, um, just because of everything we were working with in this particular photo, um, everything, we had a lot of paper snowflakes, the wig was highly flammable synthetics. Um, the headpiece had a lot of um, flammable things into it, etc. We just decided and we had movement and air conditioners going and things like that. It was safer not to actually light the candles. Now, I had previously lit the candles and had melted wax down all the sides of them and the wicks have been burnt. So... That was fine. All I needed to do then was add the candle flame and a little bit of a glow. And it's pretty easy to do that in Photoshop. So I'm going to drop down to basics and I'm going to show you how to do it. First of all, you need a candle photo. So go to somewhere like Pixabay or something like that and grab a um shot like this this one's perfect um this is by web bandy don't know but you can download download the high res image it's got a little bit of the candle it's got the flame and it's all in black so that is a perfect one to use go download it buy my cup of coffee whatever um so what we're going to do is we're then going to open this in Photoshop I'm going to grab a selection and I want some of the candle and I'm going to copy and paste or cut and paste and then I'm going to drag that over to my image now it's way too big but that's okay I'm just going to resize it and get it to roughly what I want now a really easy way to figure out if it's lined up or not is just to drop the opacity a little bit and then you can just line it up there like that. Now, I can either drop down to screen, which is actually going to get rid of all of the black. That's probably the easiest way to do it. It will keep some of the candle there. So if you want to, you can come in with the eraser if you wish to and just get rid of that little bit. And then you are just left with the flame. And all you have to do then is just copy and paste that. So let's just copy and paste it or control J to copy it and Move that onto all my other images. And it's pretty easy. I would then just pop them all in their own little folder. I'm just going to do that. Now all you need to do is add a little bit of a glow. Now what I did with mine, I've just gone and got a little bit soft brush and on a new layer so I'll turn that one off and come in with white and make sure it is a nice soft brush and just paint over each of those and again if you set that to screen mode and then you can drop the opacity down if you prefer you can have that behind the candles um, or you could have it in front of it. That's a really quick and easy way to add a candle flame to your images. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.